papers. And again, there's the label. If you when you go to stow it, you have got that. It also comes with these rub-ons. Again, like I said, they're slightly translucent. So there's uh, two sheets. The eight by eight. And then again, the frames and tags are now chipboard. Um, so there's, they're considerably thicker than they had been previously. It was more like die-cut paper. And um, this is actually more like what we had seen, the tags. It's the same density as what the tags and um, frames were in the last release. So I like the change. Um, they are bringing back chipboard, which means they probably found a good supplier. That's good news for everybody. And that is Grow With Love. So those are the, the, the most recent releases from Graphic 45. The pre-orders are shipping right now and they're available for uh, purchase right now at Scrap and Create. So thanks for tuning in and watching us on these reveals. We appreciate you guys spending your time with us here. And as always, have a great night. See you later. Hey everyone, it's Daphne from Scrap and Create and we're going to go over Graphic 45's newest collections. The Beach is Calling and the next one is Grow With Love. So I really like this beach, this beach collection. It does definitely remind me of the East Coast more than the West Coast, but it's, um, it's a beautiful collection. It reminds me a few years back they did a collection with starfish and it was this blue and tan and I really liked it. Um, so let's get started. So we're going to start with the um, paper pack. Then I'm going to go over the patterns and solids. Okay, so there's the starfish. Little beach huts. <laughs> these are fun. Um, I'm so glad they added these to the collection. I, I loved the um, ephemera journaling cards. And when they went away, I was so disappointed. And I'm like, just put them in the pack. We can cut them ourselves. And I'm glad they did. So there's the postcards for this collection. Card toppers. High times, good times. There we go. And there's a pretty traditional Graphic 45 stripe. This works great. I love it. Let's go to the beach. This is a great uh, vacation collection. The beach is calling. Okay, that's the cover work. That's nice. I love stamps. They're so easy to embellish with. A nice background. Ooh, look at that. Oh, love it. Love it, love it. This is a great page. Okay, so that is the collection pack. So here is the patterns. You get two each of eight designs. It's kind of interesting. They packed it upside down, or at least I feel like it is. So there's the um, navy blue. That's a rich blue, too. I don't know if it's coming across in the video, but it's very dark and rich, which is going to make for a strong contrast to those tan pages. Okay, and then this is where we turn into the sort of sandy color. It actually looks a little more gold here. Stripes, I love stripes. And then we're coming into kind of a sky blue. We got the two stripes. There we go. So that is the Beach is Calling Patterns and Solids. Additionally, in this collection pack, we have the tags and frames. And new on this release, these tags and frames are actually chipboard. So they're not just die cut paper, they're chipboard. In addition, we have the Ephemera Assortment Pack, which is thicker than their paper, but not as thick as the chipboard. Um, it's a little bit more rigid and it's actually a little uh, glossier. Um, so these are really nice. 
the, this is kind of weird, but the stickers are now separate, um, sold separately. And then the stickers are also thicker and nicer than they used to be, which I like. I mean, I can really feel the difference even inside the package. So the weird thing is the way these came in, they came in with this on the top, right? The title of the collection. But we cut it off because it made it not fit in the package with the 12 by 12. So it's inserted inside, but we trimmed off the label and just inserted it inside the package. So it's a little bit odd, but this means that you're actually getting a little bit more stickers and a larger, a slightly larger scale because they're not using any of the header. Um, they're using 100% of the space for the stickers themselves. So it's, it's a little odd, but I just want you guys to know that that's there, that's not a mistake. And there was a, a reason why we did it. This is um, kind of new with Graphic 45, and these are these rub-on trans uh, transfer sets. So they're kind of interesting, and they're slightly translucent, so when you apply them, you can see a little bit of whatever you're applying them on top of. This is great for people that like to do art journaling or just journaling in general. You can do some of your journaling and then put a rub-on right on top of part of the words if you want to or you can journal around it. And then also everything, you know, it comes in the eight by eight collection pack as well. So that's a graphic 45. The beach is calling, which I really like of the new collections. That's the one I would get. Well, I'd get them all, but the one I would want to work on first. Okay, the next collection is Grow With Love. Right here, we've got our journaling cards. They're very bright, beautiful, beautiful spring collection. Nala, sorry, my dog is misbehaving. There we go. Some daffodils, which I think are beautiful, but don't smell so great. I can definitely see most of these patterns would work for Easter so well. Spring in general. That's pretty. This will make a a nice card array. There we go. Got some sentiments, strips, and then here is the cover image. Beautiful. Okay. And then we've got our patterns and solids. As you can see there's a faint pattern, even in the solid part. And it's kind of a floral array. It looks like a mum. It's that pattern, just very pale. Ooh, it looks really good together. This is a really interesting pink, I like it. Okay, that is the patterns. So in addition to, to that, comes in an 8x8. Eight eight. Again, here's the sticker sheet, and I can't, I can't tell you, but I mean it is considerably thicker um, than previous, and I really like it. And looking at it closely, um, the, um, the cutouts where they've actually stamped it They've done a really good job of um, lining up the 
die cut with the pattern itself. You know how sometimes they can be misaligned. They look really good. I mean, look how tight that is. So that's the stick.